Day uh, all over the world actually is celebrated and there's parades in many, many, many major cities and it's high time that Winnipeg caught up, right? Uh, well, we started organizing it in January and uh, started making some of the floats back in January as well. Uh, many of them are made uh, clearly of recyclables. <laughs> some paper mache, definitely some chicken wire. I think I bought Winnipeg out of chicken wire at one point. And, uh, and a whole lot of fun and, you know, a couple of beers. <laughs> We got some music now. It's not amplified though, so it's well within permit rights. <laughs> how many, oh, how the many glories people you got? Of iPods. How, how many, many people? How many people? Can everybody count one at a time? Are we like 500 maybe? I don't know, it's crazy. <laughs> so, so like, why are you doing this? Because <laughs> it's so much fun. <laughs> what does this mean to Irish people in Winnipeg? It means, uh, it means we know how to host a parade, <laughs> or maybe a party. Nice, nice. <laughs> so did you come up with the idea? Yes. Yeah. Well, sort of. I had help. You know. Yeah. It's really hard to say when you have many people stopping, when you have many people talking, then all of a sudden... In one place. Yeah. Over many beer. Yeah. Yeah, you know. I think you've been there. <laughs> we were doing some bicep curls one night, and then sort of thought, why don't we parade? <laughs> 